Okay guys, so I recently just got two guinea pigs and it was sort of a spontaneous purchase. This one is Pacino. He was purchased last Sunday and today is Sunday so it marks a week of him in my household and this one I got on Thursday. So Pacino was quite alone for a little bit. So I just, you know, researched a little bit more and I found out that they are herd animals. So I went back and I got Gizmo. He's the one drinking the water. And I just took out their house. It was right here in that area. That's why he's going back to it. He's like, where's our burrow? <laughs> And it's pretty small for right now, but it's, um, we do give them plenty of floor time every day. <laughs> so I believe that they were in the same housing together at the PetSmart. No, we got them from Petco, sorry. So when we initially, you know, introduced them to each other, they were fine. They were like, hey, I remember you. Hi. <laughs> He has a little brown patch under his his chin. And Patino, um, this one right here. He is black and brown. So I'm just gonna show you them close up. It's okay, it's okay. Um, I did give them a bunch of kale and green peppers. This one loves green peppers. He's dying for them. If you're wondering, this is the cage and I just took out all of their hiding spots so you can be able to see them. So typically a house goes right there. That is like a hammocky sort of thing that it hangs. See them? They hide. <laughs> Say hello. Let's go in there with them. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Say hi. Okay, that's my introduction to my two guinea pigs, Pacino and Gizmo. I'm, I'm gonna, you know, I don't know if I'll film, um, I'll film them as much as I, as I do. This one doesn't like when I touch him that much. He's not used to me yet, but Pacino, he's okay with it somewhat. Pacino's, he's better when I rub his back. He makes a cooey noise. He's not doing it. There you go. Hi guys. I saw the clouds roll in and run across the sky, and I hope that.